In this video, we're covering all seven of the available tablet and hotspot plans from Verizon, and you can see they offer four postpaid plans to choose from and three prepaid plans. Let's begin with the postpaid options. The first two are unlimited tablet and unlimited plus tablet, and these plans are pretty similar. Unlimited tablet is $20 a month with an active voice line on your account, or $75 a month as a standalone option. And both of those prices do include any auto pay discounts. Unlimited tablet includes true unlimited data for your tablet. However, it is limited to Verizon's nationwide 5G network only. You can use that in LTE, but you're not getting access to Verizon's ultra wideband 5G network, which boasts those impressively fast speeds. This plan includes 15 gigabytes of priority data before your speeds may be slowed down during times of network congestion. You get 15 gigs of hotspot data here, and then hotspot speeds are reduced to 600 kilobits per second. And finally, video streams at 720p. Unlimited Plus tablet is very similar, but with six key upgrades. First is the price. It's $30 a month with a voice line on your account and $85 a month as a standalone tablet plan. You're still getting unlimited data here, but the big difference is you're getting access to Verizon's ultra wideband 5G network. If you're in one of these select cities or airports or other areas with this coverage, this is gonna boast huge performance, super fast speeds, and overall offer an excellent experience. This plan also doubles the amount of priority data to 30 gigabytes before your speeds may be slowed down during times of network congestion, and you get double the hotspot data here too, also at 30 gigabytes, before hotspot speeds are reduced to 600 kilobits per second. Video continues to stream at 720p here. Now there are two other benefits to getting access to ultra wideband. When you are connected to ultra wideband 5G, you get unlimited high speed hotspot data, which is gonna be huge for doing work on the go and sharing your cellular connection with your other devices. Also, you can now stream videos at 4K quality, which means they're gonna look awesome on your larger tablet screen. The one thing I will say is if you wanted to stream HD video quality on the regular unlimited tablet plan, you can do this by using a VPN. The VPN hides your network traffic from Verizon. They can't actually tell what kind of content you're consuming. And because of this, they don't know if you're watching a video or just browsing a regular website. And as a result, you get full uncapped video streaming speeds. This lets you enjoy all your favorite videos and shows in full 4K quality. Next, we have Verizon's two postpaid hotspot plans. And up front, these are pretty bad, uh, but let's dive into them anyway. We have unlimited hotspot up first, $20 a month with a voice line and $75 a month as a standalone plan. And you basically just get 15 gigs of data here. Then your speeds are reduced to 600 kilobits per second, which is pretty slow, though you technically could stream video at around 480p quality or maybe 360p quality at those speeds. Again, this plan is limited to Verizon's nationwide 5G network, as well as their LTE network, so no ultra wideband 5G access here. And you are limited to 720p video streaming, although if you use a VPN, you can bump that up to 4K, but only for your first 15 gigs of data usage, because then all data will be capped at those 600 kilobit per second speeds, and there's nothing a VPN can do about that. If you choose to upgrade to Unlimited Plus Hotspot, uh, this is $30 a month with an active voice line or $85 a month as a standalone option. You're getting 30 gigabytes of data here and then reduced speeds at 600 kilobits per second. So a little bit better. And you're also getting access to ultra wideband 5G. Same as the previous plan, video quality is limited to 720p unless you are using a VPN. And getting access to ultra wideband 5G comes with two additional benefits here. You get 50 gigs of high speed data and then data speeds are capped at three megabits per second, and you can stream video at up to 4K quality, at least for the first 50 gigs, and then I think with the three megabit per second cap, you're probably gonna be limited to around 720p. Honestly, this plan is just confusing and pretty bad. Ultra wideband has huge, huge capacity and delivers those gigabit per second speeds, so in my mind, there's really no reason Verizon should impose this ridiculous three megabit per second cap. Another important thing to note here is Verizon customers on the do more plan or the get more plan can actually save 50% off tablet and connected device plans. 
This means the unlimited tablet plan would be just $10 a month and the unlimited plus tablet plan would be just $15 per month. And these discounts would also apply to the unlimited hotspot and unlimited plus hotspot plans. Okay, those are the postpaid options. Let's talk about prepaid. There are three options here, $35 for six gigs, $45 for 16 gigs, and $65 for 30 gigs. And there's not a whole lot to cover here because these are just bad. If you go to Verizon's website, you can even see they're offering the double data promotion where you're getting two times the amount of data included with your plan than you otherwise would. And the data amounts are still super small. These plans are expensive, don't come with a whole lot of data, and I just can't recommend them. If we do bring them back here, what I would recommend instead are plans from US Mobile. Here, $15 gets you five gigs of data. You can get $20 for 12 gigs of data, $25 for 18 gigs, $30 for 30 gigs, and $45 for unlimited. These plans and prices are significantly better than what Verizon is offering with their prepaid options. US Mobile is prepaid, and these plans do work in tablets. The one thing to take into consideration is Verizon's prepaid plans do work in both tablets and hotspots, whereas with US Mobile, these plans will just work in tablets. They're not compatible with hotspot devices. If you need more hotspot data, I would highly encourage you to consider one of Verizon's home internet plans. They offer two options here, home internet over LTE, which is $40 a month with a Verizon mobile plan, or just $60 a month without a mobile plan, and they also offer Verizon 5G home internet. This can give you better speeds and performance if you're in an ultra wideband 5G coverage area, and the price is just $50 a month when you have a Verizon mobile plan, or just $70 a month without a Verizon mobile plan. Both of Verizon's home internet options offer no data caps, up to 1080p video streaming, and are gonna give you way more value for your dollar if you need cellular connection at home. That's it for this video. Click the like button if you found it helpful, subscribe for more videos like this one, and Patreon supporters can now vote on what video I make next. And if you wanna cast your vote, be sure to join the Patreon. Tons of awesome perks and benefits, and I hope you enjoy. Thank you for watching, I'm Stetson, and I'll see you next time.